hello everyone welcome back to my channel so today I want us to do some cooking and we're going to spend 12 pounds and 37 pence to cook so we're going to be making some spaghetti with some vegetables so let's start so I've got myself um, sunflower oil from Tesco you can see so that's a sunflower oil from Tesco and that cost just about the whole bottle costs one pound and nine pence we're going to use i like to add um oyster sauce the panda brand of oyster sauce it normally costs about two pounds in tesco so as you can see i'm not going to use all of the oil so you can use it over and over again i'm not going to use all of it so you can use it over and over again and we've got soy sauce which cost about one pound forty and um, i've got ginger here i got this ginger from tesco and the ginger cost about 99 pence i've got garlic so i bought from different shops so this is garlic the whole of garlic i'm not going to use all of it so you can use all these over and over again so the garlic actually cost one pound in Iceland and I've got the spaghetti as you can see this spaghetti in Tesco costs um, 70 pence and I've got some organic carrots as you know I'm not going to use all of it so you can use it for several other things I might just use about two of the garlic and um, of the carrots and this carrot organic carrots cost one pound and I've got some sweet mixed peppers as well so this sweet mixed peppers cost only one pound 29 from uh, Lidl and you can use just one of it um, one in some shops like Tesco one of these is about 45 pence and then I've got some onions and with the onions as well I'm not going to use all of it and this onions cost one pound in Iceland finally I've got chicken strips uh, chicken breast fillets from Tesco um, and this chicken breast fillet as you can see cost one pound ninety I'm going to use all of it so as you can see I'm not going to use every all of all some of these things I might use just one onion one uh, sweet mixed peppers I might use one ginger maybe two carrots all of the spaghetti a bit of oil and a bit of so actually in the end this food is not going to cost 12 pounds it might be let's say six to seven pounds because some of the items are going to be left over and we can use for other things later so join me and let's see what we can get from 12 pounds 37 pence we'll see <laughs> So as you can see out of the 12 pounds 37 pence uh, ingredients I bought the only thing I'm going to be using all of it is the spaghetti you can see I've only got two carrots one of the three onions just a little bit of the garlic I've got one of the ginger I've got one mixed sweet pepper and I've got all of the spaghetti which I've just boiled some hot water to cook it so it's quicker so as I said although I've spent 12 pounds 37 pence to buy all these ingredients um, there is leftover so let's say this meal we're going to be cooking might only cost about four pounds fifty and um, how good is that so anyway let's cook the spaghetti and then we'll carry on from there just switched on the cooker and I've got the spaghetti add some hot water and I will let it cook um, with the hot water it helps it to cook faster so I will continue from there when it is cooked yeah there we go so the spaghetti is cooking very nicely it should be ready in a few more minutes and we shall 
um, strain it in a bit. So I've just chopped the, the pepper and the onion so I'm just going to be grating um, the carrots whilst I'm cooking oh come on <laughs> so whilst I'm cooking the spaghetti just getting the other things ready so this is how it's coming out nicely so we'll show you the finished work later I'm going to be grating the ginger and garlic um, I cannot cook without adding ginger and garlic especially for the chicken so I'm just going to use that to marinate the chicken so um, I think I should grate it on the fine side you can actually blend it as well but it's easier to grate it um, oops I'll do that and then I'll do the garlic as well and then I will just use those to to season my chicken so this is the chicken breast fillet which is one pound ninety from Tesco I have nicely grated the garlic and the ginger ready to season it um, so as I said out of all the items or the ingredients I bought I'm using all of the chicken breast fillet which cost one pound ninety and also I'm using all of the um, spaghetti which is 70 pence so 70 pence plus one pound 90 is two pound 60 I believe and the rest is just one of each one of each one of it so if you calculate that I think um, this meal is going to cost us almost just about four pounds 50 um, according to my own estimation anyway let's crack on with the chicken okay there we go so I'm just going to cut it like that like that oops and then I'll just cut it again into smaller pieces just a little smaller So this is the chicken all chopped up nicely just adding a bit of salt and I've got the the grated ginger and garlic I'm just going to add this and just mix it nicely to season it uh, there we go so I've got ginger everything salt in here all ready to go and all the chopped um, onion, mixed sweet pepper, the carrots, and then the cooked spaghetti, all ready to go. Oops, sorry, just touch that. So I'm just adding some oil into the the wok. I would say not too much oil. Um, and I've just switched on. Let it heat up a little bit there we go so the oil seems to be nicely heated up so I'm just adding the chicken so we just leave the chicken to brown a bit and then we continue from there So as you can see, uh, the chicken is um, cooking really nicely and because of the ginger and the garlic, it's has So as far as I can see, it's nicely cooked, slightly brown. You can do it to your own choice, the way you want it. There is no blood in it, so it's all cooked now. So what I'm going to do next is to set it aside um, so I will set it aside so this is the I've just added a little bit oil to the leftover oil I'm just adding the onion again just 
leave it to thin out a little bit, fry it a little bit. At the same time, actually, you can just add the sweet pepper because you don't want to overcook it. When you make the spaghetti, you want to fill it a little bit crunchy as well. So we are not going to cook this for too long. And you can see I've got the oyster sauce and the soy sauce on the side to use just to give it a little bit of extra taste. That is all good. Actually, the spaghetti is quite a lot. So if you're the only one living at home, you can actually take some off, keep in the fridge, and then another day you can do the same. Ooh, it's quite a lot. <laughs> and this is just one spaghetti, which costs um, 70 pence. Looking really good. At this point, I'm just going to add the carrots that I've just grated to give it some, some colour. Oh, that looks really nice, isn't it? Yeah, it's a bit of colour. also going to add at the same time the chicken that we've already uh, browned a little bit so there we go that looks really good finally we shall add the sauces so this is the oyster sauce the panda brand I don't like to add a lot because it can be a bit salty so I just add a little bit I'm also going to add some soy uh, yeah this is soy sauce the other one was oyster sauce so a bit of soy sauce not too much it depends on how you want it as an individual so you just mix it mix all of it together oh, that's really lovely And actually, that is our meal almost done. So as I said, all these would cost, let's say about £4.50 because um, there's leftover spaghetti I'm going to keep in the fridge and use for another day. And you can easily do this at the world. Um, I've got two more onions from the £1 onion I bought. I've got two more sweet pepper from the three that I bought, which was one pound. I've got loads of, uh, a couple of ginger left. I've got loads of garlic left. And so the only things that I've used all of is the chicken, which is one pound ninety. And I've used all of the spaghetti. Um, I cooked all of it, which is one pound uh, 70 pence. So yeah. It's quite easy, it's quite cheap, and this is something you can cook after work. And actually, you can do this within 45 minutes when you get back from work. And you can make this to eat on Saturday evening as well. So anyway, we're going to serve the food in a minute. Um, let's enjoy. <laughs> Thank you. 
Thank you.